Once again, guys, this is Investor Show. As always, this is your host, Prince Dice, coming to you guys live from Japan. What? You thought I was guys going to say? You guys thought I was probably going to say Hawaii. But uh, anyway, uh, right now I'm in Japan. And as you guys can already see in the description box, uh, this video is going to be a quick tutorial on how to set alarms inside of uh, E-Trade. And I think, hey, yo, don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, comment, share button, thumbs up, thumbs down. Leave me some comments if you guys got any comments for me and all the other great stuff. But I'm just show you how to set up a quick um, few alerts since I did E-Trade. But as always, I don't have a lot of time, and I definitely know you guys don't have a lot of time, so we're going to jump straight into it. So as you guys can see, I have E-Trade pulled up here, and it's the four stock. So right here is just regular E-Trade. The four stock is a F. So what that does is, you know, this is the typical E-Trade app. But if you scroll on down here just a tad a little bit, it says alert me when F, which is the forward stock, reaches whatever the case may be. So if you can set an alert to say, hey, right now the stock is trading at $12.40, you can set an alert to tell you, hey, send me an alert if this stock hits $9, $11, $13, $15, $17, and more on, right? So I'm going to show you a couple more alerts you can do as well. So as you guys can see, I already kind of set little alerts here, just playing around with it or whatever, making sure I tested it. But what you do, you go in here, you type in the stock symbol, you know, let's say if it was Facebook. And let's do four because I don't know the top of uh, Facebook right now, the top of my head price. But you can set a high. You can say, hey, if it gets up to this high, you can put in $15. You can say, hey, if it get to this low, you can put in $10. Then you can even say, hey, if it goes up, 2% in a day, let me know. Hey, if it goes down 2% in a day, let me know. Uh, PE high target, PE low target. PE is price earnings, and price earnings pretty much tells you if a stock is overvalued. The price of the stock compared to the earnings that it report is telling you, you know, that's a, a sign people use to tell you if a stock is trading very high or very low. So why would someone care if a price target is high? Because they could be interested in shorting the stock. They could say, whoa, the stock is very bloaty and it could be uh, going down. Something that I called a long time ago on Tesla. But anyway, all the price earning is low. This is one of the tricks by uh, Warren Buffett, one of his tips. He looks for a price earning ratio that is very low. Look for an undervalued stock that he can buy. So if you're looking for a low PE ratio, you can say, hey, this could be a perfect time to buy and hold for the long term. Uh, also, you can put in the volume. The volume is how many times the stock is traded within a particular period or a day. Hey, if this is traded 15 times or if it hits this high volume, then I know that, hey, this stock is uh, sending a lot of action or whatever the case may be. That could be part of your strategy that people use. So here you go. You have people that may want to get into it when it's high so they can undercut it. Or they want to get into it when it's low so they could bet up on it or whatnot, whatever the case may be. Depending on what your investment strategy is. Once you got that in or whatever you want to do, you just hit the add button. Boom, right? And you will be alerted when those particular targets hit. Also, you can go to this tab right here and go to news. And also in the news, you can set it up to say, in particular, let's say if you're looking for four stock again, right? When it gets upgraded or downgraded, let me know. If it's in play, let me know. If it has earnings, if it has a split notice. You can put these notifications to let you know if a particular stock has been upgraded or downgraded. Upgraded or downgraded is like you're more standard and poor. They go out and they uh, upgrade stocks or they downgrade them, you know, give them one star, two star, three stars, all that other stuff like that. So you may want to know this. If you may hold a stock and you just want to be abreast. So you just hit the add button on that as well. So you can do portfolio digest and new issues. Like if you want to get in contact when an IPO hits. You can let it let you know as well. But anyway, that's a quick little video to show you how you can set some alerts uh, for whatever, you know, to add a little tool to your arsenal. Um, don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, comment button. Uh, thank you guys for all the great support out there. Until the next video, you guys already know what to do. Peace, be safe, and I'm out.